Mastering the blending technique on bodywork will help prevent colour differences and will achieve the optimal integration of the port to repair with its adjacent ports. Let's see the advantages of this technique and the guidelines to follow to master its application. The blending technique consists of applying the colour to certain areas of the parts that are adjacent to the one to repair, reducing the amount of paint to be applied from more to less with a smooth transition. The blending technique will allow us to reduce the product consumption and working time by optimising the processes such as masking or assembly and disassembly of parts. Relying on a painting system that offers an excellent blending effect will be the best ally in any type of repair. In general, this technique will be applied in cases such as highly visible body areas like wings or doors, replacement parts to enable their integration into the bodywork, in complex colours such as metallic, pearl or free coat colours to optimise the orientation of the special effect particles, and damage caused to edges of parts that are adjacent to other parts, especially in the same plane. Depending on the size of the damage to be repaired and where it is located on the part, the blending effect can be classified into two types of repair. This type of blending will be used for small or medium sized damage that is far from the edge of the adjacent parts. There must be enough space before reaching the edge of the part to repair, to prevent any possible colour differences. Once the intermediate coat is correctly prepared, apply a first coat of colour with a subtle gradient in all directions of the patch's edges, without spreading out too far. A second larger coat that completely covers the patch, with a gradient from the outside to the edges of the patch, without applying any colour to the edges of the part. In metallic colours, it is advisable to apply a control coat for better colour adjustment and particle orientation. Finally, apply the clear coat. When replacing new parts, or when the damaged area is too large, apply colour to the whole part, blending the part to repair and its adjacent parts. This technique is usually used on side parts, such as doors or wings, due to their vertical orientation, which can cause greater variations in colour and brightness. First, apply a first coat spreading slightly all the way to the adjacent part or parts. Then, apply a colour coat to the adjacent parts, blending obliquely from the damaged part to the opposite end. Finally, apply a control coat and the final clear coat.